The emulators have input lag. Okay. Yeah, that's true. Okay, so I'd be running the relevant version. Okay. I know that, uh... Because I was looking into it, I know that the Legacy Collection 2 is like 8 seconds faster optimally or something. Okay. Alright, alright. Yeah, thanks to, uh, Maple and all those guys. Shoutouts to Maple. <laughs> Jeez. Random crashes. That sounds really bad. Um, I don't know, man. I, uh... I've been on kind of a downturn lately as far as, like, speedrunning. So I haven't really felt really, uh... What's the word I'm looking for? Um... Motivated, I guess. Maybe it's because I'm so fucking tired from my job all the time. I try to get sleep and then I just can't. Alright, Esco. Uh, thanks for stopping in uh, and hanging out for a bit, dude. I'll see you later. Yeah, it's just the whole, like, having to learn, like, a whole new game thing that just kind of, like, throws me off. Nice, dude. How, uh... How far do you know in the game so far? Oh, also I'm going to be doing Final Fantasy VII again. That's another thing. I'm going to be doing a PC any percent. Gold saucer. Nice, dude. That's pretty good. It's a decent chunk in. It's like right after Costa del Sol, correct? Yeah, yeah, that would be, be storyline-wise, anyway. Nice. That's awesome. Um. Yeah. I'll, also, I'm doing Resident Evil 4 again, so that's another thing. to do the mini games perfectly. Oh, okay, I see. That's like a requirement. Oh, is that where you like do the salute thing for like Heidegger and Rufus and shit? Okay. That sucks. <laughs> Good luck on carry armor, that's all I'm saying. That's gonna blow. I know he's like... The shitter of the entire game. Oh my god, dude, what is this movement? This is bullshit. Yeah, Scorf, if you need any help, dude, uh... Oh, man. Speedrun.com's got tons of shit that you can look at. <clears throat> this movement is, like, not good. 
Yeah, definitely. Krillian. Thank God when uh, PC any percent skips that. That's the category I run. Burger hugging. So, uh, what got you into the idea of wanting to run Mega Man 8? This this run has gotten to the point where like movement is really really important now, and I don't I can't like be fucking up really easy shit. If I start doing that, then I'm just gonna start losing a ton of time over the course of the run, and it's just not gonna be good. Whether or not I get like difficult battles well or not. Like before, I could kind of count on saving time with my boss battles, but now it's not really so much anymore, considering. My Ridley was godlike, my Dragon was godlike, my Fantoon was decent, my Kraid was okay. So it's like, I just have to have really good movement now. Can't depend on boss fights anymore. This category's stupid, dude. Like, I wouldn't recommend it. Unless you have any, like, sort of sanity. That you want to just, like, get rid of. It's, it's hard to do, like, how do I put this? It's hard to do it optimally, I guess. Um, there's a route that Linka did that's a lot safer. Um, he gets two extra E-tanks for Ridley. Uh, but it, you lose two minutes if you do that. Also, this route now includes a uh, new route any percent method of Meridia, which also you just have to have good movement for that too, to save time. It's just a difficult category overall, yeah. But it's like a lot of fun once you get it down. Oh my god, dude. Come on. Um, if I PB, or even if I don't PB, I'm going to go through and do a commentary video. Kind of describing, kind of describing the run. Because uh, I think it's interesting to kind of explain some stuff about it. And like why it's so difficult.
For some reason, I don't know why, I've been losing a lot of time to speed booster. Um, split. And I'm not sure why exactly. Like, I was getting like 949s optimally. Now I'm like barely breaking tens. Yeah, that definitely has something to do with it. For sure. This jump is also tough. Oh, I missed it. You can use the forward momentum to get a pretty epic jump there. Not die, please. Okay, cool. Yo. Yo. Okay. Okay. Yeah, fuck, dude. Nice reserve D boost. Really, I wanted more health than that, but that's okay. This will actually help because I don't have to use my reserves later. Managing your reserve tanks is a huge thing in this run, too, to like optimally not have to go on the menu and shit. That was a pretty good split, though. Thirteen Lake. Let's go. Unfortunately, I kind of messed this up. That's okay. Alright, here's the strat. Let's do it. Let's get it. Aha! Fuck. Lame. Alright, see you, Link. I have a good stream, dude. Thanks for stopping in. Oh, even more lame. I just didn't think to... Okay. Wow. Okay, so... I now run the risk of dying? This next section. Wow, now I really run the risk of dying. Oh. 
I love underwater mechanics. I clearly pressed right and I went left. Like, what is that? As I was falling, I pressed right and she just like hung up really hard left into that rock. Like, this is the greatest game ever. Imagine falling at a time like this, I know. <clears throat> no! Dude! Get out of there without getting hit, please. Oh my god. That was stupid. Yeah, that actually really helped out because that, uh, I didn't have to, like, knock my health down at all. It helped out a lot, but that was extremely scary. That was pretty fucking epic. I should try to do that every time. Yeah, that looked pretty clean. Any save is a good save, really, at this point. Alright. Now, let's hope for at least better drop RNG than before. Last time around, I got screwed pretty hard on drop RNG. I think I might have to get more power bombs. As these power bombs, I don't think I have enough. If we get 12, we'll be good. Okay, we're good. It's sketchy, dude.
That was way fucking wicked good. Dude, let's fucking go, dude. Holy shit. Dude, okay. That sucks. But whatever. There could be worse things. I'm more concerned about my health right now than anything. Yeah, it wasn't that bad. So this is where the route drastically changed. Uh, Linka used to go Main Street and up through Aqueduct and all that shit. But with new route, um, any percent, we go this way. Fuck! I do have a lot of supers though, so that's kind of nice. Okay, I lost 14 seconds? What? Oh, well, yeah. A lot of those seconds were me fucking up that thing. Okay. Not a big deal. We already established that. Okay, so...
<laughs> oh, yikes, dude. I thought that was going to end me for sure. Fuck. I honestly wish I had better health right now. This is kind of sketchy. Yeah, that's a little small uh, movement optimization that really kind of just saves you like a second or two. Instead of that slow moving, like, underwater space jump shit. Get Reco's round two. I missed this in the PB here. Yo, we in there. Okay, I have a pretty comfortable health right now, so we're good. I'm happy with this health. <clears throat> And we got high opener. Oh. Nice. That's pretty good. Alright, this is where I feel like I can save some more time because uh, my crate split wasn't that good. I, uh, I messed a lot of the movement up to crate. I messed it up, so. We're gonna get the hungry, hungry hippo strat this time, too. Got it. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's the hippo strat. It's pretty good. So this is another small change I've made too, kinda. Damn it. Alright, so what I do here is uh, instead of going top route, um, I'm going like that. I make these extra two door transitions to grab this E-Tag. Yo, setting trend, how's it going? Set on trend. Thanks for the follow, dude. Okay, so basically I grabbed that E-Tank. Um, this is for RNG manipulation. Um, as you guys probably know, Torian 
you need to have a set amount of super missiles or missiles really to do anything with uh, mother brain so if you have really low health the metroids tend to like health bomb you so I grab that E-Tank there so I can pretty much ensure perfect missile RNG with the Metroids. And that actually really does so. Gotta love it. Okay, point six. I'm cool with that. Okay. <clears throat> All right, guys. This is kind of intense. If you guys remember correctly, I lost a lot of time at the end of the run here. If I remember correctly, it was around 25-ish seconds in Turian, so... Let's go. Let's do it. One minor slip up with my hand and that whole room's fucked. Spark. Okay, Courier 6, how's it going, dude? Thanks for the follow, man. Okay, well that Turian was ass, but um, it's okay. Again? How, dude? I sparked literally on the frame I needed to. Oh well, I guess. Whatever. That's true, I won't lose any time. I'm definitely not gonna gain it. The only thing I could lose time on is Turian itself.
least I got a quick release from that. I wasn't like stuck and she was like sitting there for a while. That's the Metroid from uh, Metroid 2. Okay, sweet. Ugh, 36. I was getting pretty nervous there for a second. How can you just tell me that? Oh shit, dude. You asked, I'm just saying. Congrats, little fellow. Thanks, dude. Twenty-seven. Okay, that is what I wanted out of this run, honestly. 